phone. Oh yeah, just tune them in like you just made a banger at Smooth Studios, da da da. Where? No, I mean. Go. Or we over here in Hazard, my bro. We just recorded the banger at Mixed by Smooth Studios. He's the hottest producer in the tri state area. Get with him. Uh, what do you think about relationships right now, like in this generation? Like, all that lovey dovey shit is different nowadays. You feel me? Like, bitches aren't loyal dudes like it's 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 just not like a real like it's just hard to make that shit happen like have getting married and shit at shit. one point if, and there's less marriages if she ain't your wife and you ain't got kids with her fuck her at the end of the day a lot of these bitches really ain't shit they ain't got much to offer Real man looking for a woman with values and morals. Looking for, a, we're not looking for a hot girl. We're looking for a, a woman to raise our children. You know. So, a lot of these girls only got nothing to offer is pussy. And if all you got to offer is pussy, then that's all I want. What's your favorite food to eat? Pussy. <laughs> 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 nah, probably my favorite food to eat. Probably I like uh, I like chicken biryani. It's an Indian dish. That's just fire. But if other than that, peanut butter and jelly. What's the beverage? The bev. Uh, water is the best, but I don't know. Probably milk. That's fucked up. He's really taking his dreads off. <laughs> like, let the little kid make his own decision. I would be so tight. Could never let nobody. That's when like off. your parents used to have control over your hair. And shit. Oh, oh, like his his dad made him chop it, or his mom made him chop it. Yeah, look, his dad was his dad's a barber. Oh, I seen this video. Yeah. You feel me? You probably they were probably like, you got to take it off now. It's been too long. You know what I mean? When you a little kid, you can't make that decision. Yeah. Your parents like got control over your hair. Kind of just weird. That's why I said, it. don't cut me with those hair, man. That's why he wanted his hair cut. Yeah, he wanted it. I say they all got their hair cut when they wanted it. We didn't force him to. He wanted it like that. He saw saw one of the streamers and shit. My dress, I go bald. I don't care how long. Ain't, it <laughs> ain't that ain't that much longer, bro. Got my jeans. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> one guy we call him one dress. <laughs> <laughs> you heard Roman Brown the Wolf Yeah, I just seen him the other day. Oh, word? Yeah, I think he's still riding his motorcycle. He was riding like an asshole down the street. Like. Raining out, snowing out. In yeah, 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 it was raining. He did like a U turn in the middle of Main Street, start backing up. He was funny, bro. Probably still a little older. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he does. Um, what do you think about, like, gangsters, like, are snitching nowadays, like, you know what I mean, you have Gunna saying he'll never rat in a song, and then, look, he did that shit, 6 9 he did that shit, like, what do you think about gangsters snitching and stuff now, like, it's, well, it's fine in the rap game, and they're accepted. Well, I mean, I, I don't, I wouldn't call 6 9 a gangster, I think that was just a money scheme for the boys, like, the gang, whatever, 9 trade, whatever it was, but, I mean... 
I guess you could say they should have seen that coming. You know, he wasn't ever about that life from what I heard. I mean, I ain't no fuck. I ain't in the streets and shit like that no more, so I don't know, but he seemed like a soft bread nigga from the jump anyway. <laughs> so, and he didn't, like, grow up with them, ride with them, so that's not, like, his brothers, you know what I mean? So, like, they was fucking his girl, kidnapping him and shit. I don't know if he owed him any loyalty, but if but if he if he claims to be a gangster and really about that, maybe you shouldn't snitch. But at the same time, how do you define a snitch? The difference between a snitch and a rat. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Like I said, I learned from Nipsey. Go legit. Don't gotta worry about that. You make your money. I'm gonna say and get this cut. Go on. Uh, I don't know if you're a Knicks fan or not, but how do you feel about the Knicks? Uh, like that we're good now. Like you know what I mean? The Knicks are nice. Shit, my favorite team is. Uh, you know, they lost the last two games. My favorite team is. Uh, what are they called? <laughs> <laughs> no. You don't want to know your team. You don't even want to I don't anymore. know. I had a hat when I was in this halfway house, and it was a. Uh, Shit, I'm mad at that. I'm a Lakers fan. So. The Mavericks, I think. What? I like the Mavericks. That's only because of the hat. I don't know anybody. I feel bad for Bron. Bron's in a cast right now. That's good. Enough. What happened to him? He like twisted his shit. He always getting hurt now. He older. Oh, he got enough money. He good. That's that's why they're all leaving Russell Westbrook wide open now. And shit, cause. You know what I mean? Like he's not even a threat. Draymond Green literally like did that on purpose, and like. I guess Russell can't shoot no more is what that means, but like, damn. Nah, he never really could, to be honest. Wow. That's why I get the wow. this, right? Yo, so do I get a CD? A CD? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> How old are you? Uh, 19. Oh, damn. Yeah. yeah, when I was 19, we were still burning CDs a little bit. There's still somewhat in there. No, I was just confused. I could do all that shit. Like, I have all that shit in my house, but, like, it's just a different era. Like, yeah, I, no, I, it's like someone I'm not, like, like, with what? them. Like, I'm, I'm young. I'm 19. I'm not with all them youngins. Like, I'm still, like, like everything you were talking about, like, I know, like, yeah, but you me, carry yourself, it was like, a struggle. Like, these dudes, like, you see, like, imagine someone's first time coming. You used me here. Fucking banger song that could blow up, go on charts, get a fucking Grammy for it. Like back then, like, like the quality wasn't that great. Nah, like, yeah. You feel me? Like these kids that be coming in here sometimes, I'll be like, y'all got it so good. Like, you uh -huh. feel me? So easy, dude. And like, feel me? Nah, facts, straight up. I'll, I'll definitely fuck with your hustle though. No cap. This is this is lit. I uh, appreciate it. What do you think about the new generation, like of rap, like what you hear on the radio and some of it's I. Right. I mean, the beats be I. Right. I'm a dancing nigga, so I could dance. But some of that shit, like I don't know, it just don't seem like rap to me. And niggas don't be really saying too much about it's nothing. It's just rhymy stuff that's catching yeah, you know, piss me off is that funk flex and all the. You feel me? They said they're like, yeah, fuck it. We don't even give a fuck about the love about music. We're just gonna play the rhymy shit. And shit that rhymes that people could bounce to. Like now, it's not even about like they just they just. It's not about people. like telling a story to poetry on it. It's more <laughs> yeah, about like just, just what's bothering. And they bothering. said that, and not yeah. Like, I was but at, like, the, at the same time, like yeah, it, like like back even before rap, you know, jazz started it all. So music constantly changing and changing. But I mean, how much can you change a variance or something before it's not the same thing anymore? You know. Little pump, little pump, little pump, little pump. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I he, mean? He like, died out. I heard that he's coming back with something. He got a new song yeah. that just released or something like that. With Smoke Perk. He came, ba he came back, but like, feel me? Like his buzz when Gucci Gang was out? Oh my God. Oh yeah, that was my shit. I ain't gonna lie. Like it's I just, just that. what that is though, like that's not even rap. That's it's just good, song, it's good marketing. Yeah. Same reason why most of these stores, most of the stores you see the interior walls are yellow and red. That's why the sales items are in certain colors because it sparks interest in your mind. When you see those colors, your, your, your mind draws to them. Oh, 
Tupperware on sale, seven ninety nine. That's a good price. Let me go buy that shit. Good beat, catchy fucking hook or something like that. People start hearing it. Even people that don't like it, they're like Lil Palm, Lil Palm. Like, like Con, for instance. He'd be like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hear that yeah, shit, yeah. and now it's acceptable to him. <laughs> you know? What do you two. think about, um, dude, TikTok literally ruined everybody. TikTok and all social media ruined people's attention spans. Like, you feel me? If, like, by, like, if a video's like a minute long by two seconds, if it's not interesting, you'll skip to the next thing. Like, what do you yeah. think? It made our attention spans, all of us humans, very bad. I think that it's way bigger than just that, the whole TikTok thing. You even got a TikTok? I have one. I'll be posting, like, work shit on it sometimes, but not really anymore. I don't really go on TikTok too much. I'm mostly on Facebook advertising. People be business. like this. Just like, yeah. you know what I mean? And, like, yo, I do it, too. I be doing that shit, too. <laughs> yeah. You know, you get it to a video, you're just like, ah, the fuck they doing? They don't I've been watching cool. reels on Facebook. That's what I like doing. It's, it's all the, the same, same shit. shit. It's all the yeah. same fucking thing. There's, it's all on, you feel me? Literally, it's the same shit. couple this second video. It's all the same shit, but nah. And, and the, the, you're, you're swiping. Back then, you would stay on this for a long time. Yeah. Now, yeah. we're like. <sighs> like, it, like, we would be on a person's thing for a long time. Like, the attention span went away. So, like, when you talk to people in person, like, that means that shortens, too. Like, yeah, they're ready to get this conversation <laughs> done with and walk away. Nah, I, mean, I, hear, uh -huh. I hear that. That's how it is nowadays. It's like, it's, no it's like once you start a conversation with somebody, now you're in a race. Who can finish their sentence first? Uh, you know? Like, all right. Yeah, people don't even want to conversate yeah. in public no more. <laughs> It's just different in this generation. Like, yeah, there is some people that did, but majority of people like don't. Cause like, you know what I mean? Like, COVID made like now this shit's over. It made like a lot of people insecure and like you yeah, know, people got fucked up from that shit. Like now they're kind of some people are weirdos. You know what I mean? A lot of people are weirdos. <laughs> <laughs> a whole lot of them. And it's a lot to do with social media and everyone's feeling pressured by the social media, which is fake. You got motherfuckers. It's fake, but it's real, I nah, feel like. It, no, it definitely is real. We're all connecting on it, but it's like... Because when people are like, gonna, I'm going to pull up on you, like, I mean, it, and they do pull up on you, that's real. Like, I feel, I don't know, like, I, I, people say it's fake, but it's like, if somebody's in my DMs, which hasn't happened, I'm just saying, like, and they say they want to meet up with me, we can meet up, so, like, how is that not real? I mean, I, I, I guess it is. Like, How many people, but at the they same time. They use it time, in everybody's case. The XXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXX
Biden wants TikTok shut down immediately. He told China that shit gotta go. It should go. Look at China's algorithm on TikTok. You, you don't see nothing besides kids excelling, being great. And fucking in America, what we got? All we got is bitches shaking their ass, doing stupid little dances, and kids eating and fucking died. Like, it's ruining, like, like... It's ruined like certain. It's fine, but it's ruining like a, like certain things, like the attention spans and like a lot of human interactions and stuff like that, which is like bad. Like yeah, like mm -hmm. like like here's here's the thing, you Facebook friends with somebody, right? You see them out, they don't say nothing to you. You get home, you got a message. Hey, I saw you at the store. It's like all right, motherfucker, why you ain't say hi? <laughs> you can go wave right. to me and say what's up, because even if I I got people on Facebook and I don't know them in real life. If I see you in real life, I'm gonna be like, yo, what's up? Hey, what's up? Yeah, no, nah, yeah, Motherfucker, I comment like, on I your shit, I like your shit. I see you on the curb, you feel me? I see my boy's car, I pulled up on him, like, what up? You feel me? I see my man's walking, like, I'm pulling up on you. Like, I'm not about to text you, like, yo, I see yeah, you. Yeah, you know? Like, I was going down a highway one time, and I couldn't, I was like, damn, I would see my man riding his bike, and I couldn't. You feel me? So, feel me, days later, I told him, like, bro, I wanted to stop and say what up, but, like, I couldn't go. There was no way to go yeah. going this way on the park. I do chicks, though. Nah, yeah, I, I, I be saying what's up to Facebook friends that I don't know, but I never met them in life. And these motherfuckers be acting like they know me. down on the chicks, yeah. <laughs> uh, they was out, I'm not going to lie. They was outside in Newark last night. You feel me? I was at a party and shit. It was turned. I got the whole video and all that. That shit is crazy. Like, this shit is insane. What was you at drink drug party? Sneak beat. This was last night. <laughs> Oh, okay. I guess I just saw this that video. This shit is going viral. 101 likes already. I mean, that's my, that's my camera. She got destroyed. She got destroyed for real after that, too. <laughs> I'd be going crazy at that party, oh yeah. Sexy walk with me. This is what I mean. Now that's for my time right there. He was in Club Pure Wowing, Club Abyss Wowing. <laughs> now they just shut it down, they're, 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 they're demolishing it. This bitch started going crazy. Skinny bitch? Nah, her friend. Some big booty bitch. Come on, you get up for this one. What the mean? Yeah, see, those be the bitches that don't got nothing to offer the time pussy. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the bitch you don't find your wife in a club. And there's like a million one of them though. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like they all came there to shake ass. Yup. She like all them bitches were getting mad, like, yo, like, I need my time in front of like in front of my like the camera I was yeah. holding. They all were like fine with each like trying to like fight their way up to the front to get their Look time at my the ass. Yeah. yeah. They all wanted to do that. I'm the top slut. <laughs> I wow. swear to God, they all were like that. Use literally, that shit ain't change. Yeah. Well, they always need attention. Yeah. Women, they need it. They feed off it. They love it. Do you think uh, now that Netflix and all that's coming to Jersey, literally, like, like, do you think Jersey's gonna get like lit like Miami soon? Uh. Maybe some parts. Maybe not like Miami, but like litter, cause it's 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 kind of lit out here. I'm not gonna lie, but like nah. if it's shitty weather, like it fucking sucks, and that's the only reason why like we hate Jersey. It don't the sun don't be out for like yeah. consecutive. See, I don't know. The Jersey Shore be popping. Be gray for four days. But I know one thing though, they doing that construction. I'm working two blocks away. I'm about to go drop off hella business cards. Yeah. You need some work done. I do this. You need some subs. I do that. It's all about networking. You gotta meet the right people, right place, right time. But yeah, but the sun and stuff is like it doesn't stay out for like long. It's annoying. It stays out for like a day and then 
five days it's gray. Then the sun comes out. Like, yeah, like now. Great. Like in Florida and Miami, it's just out all the time. Who wear t-shirts all the time. Like Jersey weather, I hate it sometimes. I just don't like the cold. I don't yeah, like I don't like cold. the cold. I don't like the cold either, at all. I hate the cold. I also don't like when it's summer though. Sometimes I don't like when it's sometimes, too too hot either. Sometimes it be too hot. It's like yo, yeah, it's like I need fall to come now. But I tell you what, <laughs> I, I'd rather be outside working in the summer than in the winter. You got a good AC. It's like lit, like good AC, and then you go back out in the heat. Like if you could do something like that, it's lit. But if you just got that straight. Hot sunlight on your head. That no, I can't hot. have sun. I'm bald, my nigga. So I can't have none of that shit on my head. You put on sunscreen? <laughs> Hell yeah, my sh my should be my should be hurting after a whole day in the sun. That should be feeling brittle. It's like, oh baby, can you rub? Does it like get dead skin? Nah, I got a pretty good routine on my. I shave it a lot. I shave like every other day. Well, I try to anyway. Unless I'm working a lot, then I'd be letting that shit go. Be I'd be looking like a seven year old man. <laughs> My shit be growing, and like if I let my hair grow back and I dread it up, I look like the predator. Like you mixed, bro? Yeah, black and white. My mom's white. My uh, dad's black. Oh, so kind of white. He's like us, though. Yeah, we're mixed too. What kind of yeah, white is she? I figured. We're She's Italian. Italian. Yeah. Yeah, we're black, Italian, and Portuguese. That's hard. Oh, God. And it's crazy. You know what the crazy thing is? What? Like, my, I have a, my son. He's mostly white. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's, it's like, I don't know, the way he changes. Like, he was born with blonde hair. You know what I mean? Like, mixed races, having kids and stuff. It's pretty lit. When they grow up, they be changing. No, like, mixed people, their hair texture. Mixed so. people be the most beautiful people. Look at me. Because my hair texture changed when I got older. <laughs> I'm not nah, look at me. Nah, facts, bro. <laughs> Nigga right here had white boy hair. Yeah. His first eight years of being alive. Straight, fine white boy hair. Man, that shit just nappy. Don't say it. Fuck it. Oh, anything interesting, like, you enjoy? It's like, what do you like to, like, what do you be, like, what do you enjoy talking about, like, Beer, like what you like? Nah, I really, I pretty much just be talking about work. Work facts, like you know, like any funny stories I can get. Oh, uh, I got a lot of funny stories about this boy right here. Nah, <laughs> it's no, 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 no. <laughs> you funny? Nah, uh, we ain't got not not too much funny. I'm a carpenter, so I do all types of home improvements. And like, it could be bullshit, any like, but like people pissing you, like anything, like. Like people like I'll be doing like filming I'll be arguing with people at the driveway like not at the drive through but like they sh ran all that shit bullshit that be happening like they be that trying to play around that shit is everywhere man shit is everywhere <laughs> people be doing the stupidest shit everywhere and it don't even be making no sense I just what I hate the most is stupid questions I yeah, hate that, stupid that's, questions that's, that's like, me too. why are you I'll asking like, me bro, that bro like, it don't I make no sense do that like I can't <laughs> I don't like unrealistic, like... Yeah, like, you, you know, it's like, why are you even asking me that? It didn't even sound right when you thought it in your head, bro. <laughs> the fuck did you say it for? <laughs> oh, I'm just asking. Why? <laughs> you know, like, why? I know exactly what you mean. It'd be the old head sometimes, too. Yo. <laughs> Every time, yo. And they can't hear nothing that you say. It's like... Arr. If they didn't see it on Fox News, it ain't true. I mean, your, your ears kind of do go bad as you do get older, you feel me? Like, I do know about that stuff, so, like, like some people can't hear when they're at that age. No, my coworkers can't fucking hear for shit. They ain't even <laughs> at that age yet. They're, like, 47. I'd be yelling. I'd be like, Jim! Jim! <laughs> hey, Jim! Oh, you, you calling me, D? <laughs> it's like, yeah, bro. Can you bring me two studs? Oh, I didn't hear you. Uh, basically, I just be smoking all day at work. You're? Are you allowed? Like, do you do they don't drug test no more? Nah. I mean, when I first got hired from my job, my boss told me, nah, they didn't drug test. He said, I don't know if you smoke weed, but we smoke weed. If you don't smoke weed, don't worry, we won't judge you. <laughs> I said, but, but wait, what? 
He's like, yeah, if you don't smoke weed, we're not going to judge you for it. It's okay. So, like, all right. Did you tell them right away, or did you let them find out? No, nah, they smoke pot. My boss would be smoking pot every day. So you told them you were, you were like... Oh, yeah, I told them, I was like, too. no, I was like, I do smoke weed, but I don't be smoking at work because I don't want to do nothing wrong. But after being on the job for a couple of years, smoking, them, smoking here and there, I at first I used to be like, how the fuck these niggas smoking the bowl in the, in the van, and then they come up here, climb up on the roof, and they don't walk right the fuck off. Because I can't do it. Mm -hmm. Or cut your hand off, man. Because, you know, you get high, you get in the zone, you start doing you shingles, you start, I'll walk yeah, right the fuck off. off you yeah. know what I mean? Like I can't work. No, so a lot of people can't work high, but it just takes a while. Cause I, it used to be like I'll take two hits off a blunt at work or something like that, and I'll be high like I just face the whole blunt. Cause when you're at work, it'd be more pressure when you when you first start smoking weed at work. You know, it'd be like different. It's like oh, you second no, guess it, yourself. It, it's fine. The only time it's not fine is if you have to like walk past a ball. Like if even an also if you got a boss like around where like in that type job like. You gotta keep approaching him. He's like, hey, like, yeah. And you're like, like that's when it's like it just gets fucked up. But if you're just in the job and you could be doing, you could buy yourself with your other workers, you could be doing your own thing. Like, you'll be good. It's when you gotta keep seeing a boss or some shit in person. Yeah, I guess I guess my feels a little bit different because. Yeah, I mean, it's hard. It's it, sometimes you it, can it, see a boss anywhere. Like, it, yeah. it's, it, for you, like it's fine. But I'm always using big power tools and shit like that, climbing up ladders on the sides of houses and shit. So, in the beginning, like if you ain't never been high at work doing that shit, it ain't just like one, two, three. I mean, a boss could pull up on you at any time, though. Oh yeah, my, if, but if my boss pulls up on me, I'm just, he'll be like, "What are you doing?" I'll be like, "I'm smoking." I'll I'll, I'll let you know when I'm done. I'm <laughs> you want to hit this? <laughs> he'll be like, "Yeah, I'll take a poke." Damn. He'll take two hits and because he don't smoke with that anymore. He'll take two hits, his eyes be redder than the devil's dick. He'll be like, oh shit, I'm How fucked old up. Is he? Uh, like 48. Oh my god, he's chill. Yeah, he's all right. He's not bad. He be getting on my nerves. That's the one be asking the stupid questions. Yeah, the white dude with dreads. I think Jim cool. Yeah, he's all right. They ain't bad. It's just you know, yeah, you work with people. I've been there eight years. Sometimes the same shit be like, yo, damn, dude, again, shut the fuck up. Like, you can start to finish their sentences and shit. It's like, yo, dude, you know, everybody be reminding my wife, god damn, get on with it, bro. What? Where do you think the world is going to be in 10 years? It could be anywhere, man. Right. It could be any, it, it's, it could be a, on two different ends of the spectrum. You just told my big brother. Yeah. No way here, that's funny. I'll be watching Elon Musk. Podcasts and stuff like other people. But well, there's definitely a bigger plan, and just like you were saying before, with the attention spans on TikTok and shit like that, it's all part of the big plan. You want to call it a conspiracy theory or whatever you want to call it, but do you think we'll be in Mars, but in a couple of years? I hope so. They keep they keep in putting COVID years. in this fucking rain and this snow, this fake ass snow. They keep putting shit in there. Do you think the snow is fake? Yeah, I definitely think it was fake. That shit was all glittery. The last two dusters but why that we would they had. put fake snow? For what? <laughs> what do you mean? They're putting stuff inside of it. Oh, you think like COVID? That's my thing. When COVID first happened, we started getting all that rain. I was, I, I was saying, yo, they putting the COVID in the rain. Watch, I bet you that shit spikes. And then the news started spiking. And then I saw this movie on Netflix called The Rain. The government infected everybody with a disease. Right? So it, everybody had it inside of them, and it wouldn't come to the surface. And then fucking some chemical rain started coming down, and once it touched you, boom, it reacted with the shit inside of you, and boom, ah, you would just die. Your skin started melting off and like shit like that, you'd die. Yeah, run. exactly. So the COVID vaccine, that's all it is, is a fucking time. It's a time bomb. Enough of this shit comes out. What happens is the vaccines to stop us from getting gassed by China? Yeah, no, it ain't that. not telling us like, no, it's crazy. It's not that. I think it's going to be another war, so. Probably. Do you think there's going to be that and another round of that, like, COVID shit where they all get us to, like, get quarantined and, like, somehow get control of all of us? There's a town. Our houses there's a city in China right now. This isn't futuristic. There's a city in China right now. Everything's digital, all right? They don't use cash anymore. They use all digital currency. All Everything's through a bank account. 
Cash App, shit like that. Yeah. They use like WeChat and shit, right? They got cameras everywhere. If you fucking jaywalk on a Tuesday, the camera can detect that. Yeah, it can detect who you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It can detect if you're a fucking man, trans, or woman. And then you know what else it does? $65 jaywalking ticket. You don't even get a court date. It just fucking deducts $65 right out of your digital account. You have no say over it. Just like phones. That's control. Then, then what do they say? You don't want to get the shot? Okay, they close your accounts. You can't buy food. You can't do this. You can't do that. So what do you do? You bend over and get fucked by the man. That's what happens. New world Source. order control or some shit. You know, it's it's not far fetched. I used to always be saying like they got all these crazy sci fi movies, but it's like this can't They're just real. be this can't just be everyone's wild ma- imagination. This shit has to be like realistic. So um, you're saying you think sci fi is real? Oh yeah, they had a scene it before somehow. With the aliens and shit. You ever you ever hear of the one hundred on Netflix? Yeah, I know. I know a lot of people. I, I don't really watch it, but like I know, like bro, I see all the stuff they do. That and shit. Stuff. That shit. Bro, I see what they be 100% doing. But I, I don't know if it's like fake or not, so I never take the time to watch. Like, well, I it's a it's a fake it's a fake show. It's like uh, somebody made a story. The world ended Back by the nuclear but on that shit. But how the world ended was they Damn. created an artificial intelligence, and they asked it a question. They said, "What's the world's problem?" and solve it. Because AIs get smarter and smarter, and then they start to form their own opinions like a human does. That's how they designed them. The AI's answer was, there's too many people in this world. So it fucking hacked into the fucking nuclear system and launched off all the nukes to fucking kill everybody in the world and restart a population. But, like, where? Like, did that actually happen? No, it, it didn't actually happen. It's just like a, a science fiction movie. But it's a definite possibility. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> yeah, definitely. It's yeah. definitely a possibility. It happen. The like, robot hope, in China killed 15 workers. Nukes. I don't even think that would be real, like, Because uh, AIs are smarter than us. Yeah. They're taking, uh, the AI, what do you think about this? They're taking, like, like, the everybody's jobs, like, they got Taco Bells in L.A. That's just, they, which, is, this is kind of better, because they be, in the, they be annoying, them, sh- them shits. You just say what you want, and then when you pull up to that window, you probably pay, you pay the robot, throw the money in the machine, or whatever it is, and then when you get to the thing, it, it's like... Dude. And then it opens in your bag and your drink and everything is just perfect right there. Yeah. So they took that job away from somebody. Yep, exactly. I was watching before. They actually, Germany, they came out with a tank that's controlled only by remote control. Shot by remote what? control. Yep. That's they like actually just sent Ukraine OP. seven of them. That's like, OP. About now what happens? There. Overpowered. Yep. Now what happens, right? When they just... Like most of war fans buy drones and stuff. You know what I mean? Drone bombs. Oh, man. I definitely think it'll be, like... I think it's gonna be us. They know I'm here right now. Somebody does. They know we're here right now. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's why when you see murder cases and stuff, it's like, oh, we, we can see on your phone where you were. Everyone's gonna have their phone on them. All the time. And they could do... They could, like... When they start going into and looking at it, like they could see, like if you move right, left, here, like they yeah. see each step. So it's like, you ever, you ever, you know how like when you're looking for shit on Google and then you go on Facebook, you start seeing ads for the same shit you were searching. You'd be like, then he put his phone here. You ever, and then he brought, you ever pick up your phone, like, start scrolling, and you start seeing ads for shit that you didn't even say you were just thinking about. Yeah. And you're like, no, I didn't talk to nobody about that. What the fuck is this? Bro, they're in your fucking minds already. Also, did you know Google's ran by AI? Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. That's how they're getting the answers and shit so fast, but mm-hmm. that's just no good. Well, you know, we're, we're already on our fifth extinction. Human, The human race has been extinct five times. This life, this earth, this world. This really? Time around. Yeah, Let me hear about that. That, that sounds very interesting, to be honest. Like, yeah, no, there's a whole bunch of theories that. and shit on YouTube, but there's... Apparently, scientific proof that we're on our fifth extinction. Because yeah, I mean, turtles and dinosaurs, they're, yeah. they're going extinct, so... But, like, what about the humans? Like, we're on, we're on like, our... How f- did we go extinct? Like, what type people? Oh, I don't know. Like, the Indians that were writing in uh, the caves and shit, like... And then we came back as, like... No, us. that's this lifetime. All that Aztec, Mayans and shit like that, the Romans, the... Uh, Ancient Egypt and shit, that's all, that's all in this lifetime. So what year are you saying, like 1300s? No, like before that. Like, 
Yeah, seven thousands, like, like BC, you know, like Christ, you know, like uh, <laughs> <Jurassic> <laughs> hundreds, there's different ages, there's Jurassic yeah. age, there's different ages. They already have it all labeled. Well, I'm talking about stuff. before that, like th this is the fifth. Damn, the prehistoric the age, the Bronze Age, the Stone Stone Age, the Bronze Age, and this. There was four previous of whatever. We don't know what went on, but we well, got like, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, like we oh. built our ways up to this point from fucking stupid little caveman, like five times over. Get me set. That's why that dude want to go to Mars. Elon? Yeah. Hey. Well, he, 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 he doesn't want to go to Mars. He wants to send people first and see if they die. But he's like, no, I don't want to live there. But he, oh, he wants to do all his plans and shit out there. Well, I mean, at first, you're not going to be able to send too many people. First of all, it's going to take like four. I think it's going to take a long time to get there anyway. And then you got to like... I think it's like a one or two day trip. I don't know. I was watching. I was oh, really? Maybe. Possibly. I have no idea. I'm just saying that, but, but I heard like, if that shit is stare. way longer than that, there's no way I'm gonna be in a tube like this big and like, cause it's it's not no plane. Like you, you won't be in gravity. Like it's just I don't See, know. See, I don't even believe that they went on the moon. I think it was all fake pictures. Leo Armstrong was, was not Leo. Neil. Neil. <laughs> I think it's Neil. I don't know. But yeah, not it's the fight, Neil. Right? Uh, it ain't no Leo. But no, I think it's fake. Cause like if. If you're on the moon and you're in like a uh, like a suit and that shit rips, like you're dead. Like why are you up there jumping around all crazy and stuff? You're dead, yeah. <laughs> like if that not thing is care not the connected world. to you, yeah. Because if you don't have a string connected to you, like from what I've seen and shit, when people are in space, like you could just float away and you're never, you can't get back to that ship trying to get through gravity. It's like right. impossible. You're just gonna be like. <sighs> Like, where do you even go? Yeah, I don't know. I come up with different types of theories and shit. Shit. At one point, I thought space was water or something. Hey, he's about to leave in two minutes to come drop that off. Alright. I'll let you know. Alright, he's gonna text... What? Alright, the money's on the uh, dresser. <laughs>